On our number line so far, we have talked about positive numbers. You are about to discover that this is not the whole story. Imagine that you are in a tall building with a lift. You are currently on the third floor. If you press the button to go down, you will soon reach the ground floor, which shows as zero. If you want to go to the car park, you need to go down further. So if you go down one more floor, you have arrived at level B1, one floor below zero. And if we go down another floor, we arrive two floors below zero. Now let's look at this in a simpler way using a vertical number line. We start at the third floor, which is three on the number line. Now let's move down to zero on the number line. Move down again and we reach level B1 and then again to level B2. The concept of below zero can be represented using negative numbers. So instead of writing B1 and B2, we write negative 1 and negative 2. We can see the same movement of the lift on our new number line. Another place you may have come across negative numbers is in measuring temperature. If you went to the Sahara Desert, the temperature would be very high, maybe as high as 50 degrees Celsius. If you went to London, the temperature would be much lower, maybe around 15 degrees Celsius. Continuing further north, Moscow can get very cold. It could be 5 degrees below zero or negative 5 degrees Celsius. It would be even colder if we traveled to Antarctica, where it could quite easily be 40 degrees below zero or negative 40 degrees Celsius. Let's put all this information onto a number line. Now let's look at these number lines written horizontally, which is the way we are used to seeing them. The person in the lift going down to the car park can be represented like this. For our journey around the world, it will look like this. All negative numbers are below zero. They are to the left of zero on the number line, and so they are less than zero. All positive numbers are above zero. They are to the right of zero on the number line, so they are all greater than zero. If we move to the left on the number line once we are below zero, the numbers get more negative. If we move to the right on the number line, once we are above zero, the numbers get more positive. All positive numbers are greater than all negative numbers.